Hi everybody, welcome to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Kat, spelled with a K. Today I really don't necessarily have a plan. Um, I rather just knit and chat today. So I've got my, I've got my knitting. Uh, I don't know if this is gonna be a scarf or not. Uh, the materials are really soft though, so that's great. And you know, just a, just a little chat. Maybe. I saw uh, Dodie do this and she seemed to be kind of really in her thoughts when she did this. So uh, I really enjoyed that and hopefully it will give me something to do so I can be in my thoughts rather than rambling the entire time. All the good things that have happened to me so far this week um, that I consider good things. So, um, there's that. Also, if you see me and you are a knitter and you, maybe you can help me with this. There is one thing that I have never been able to do in all of my years is, um, all 25, uh, is be able to be ambidextrous with my knitting. Um, I can't really... So I always have to have the end that I'm crossing over to, I always have to have that um, on my left side and then the one on my right side. So I guess a good thing number one this week was that I felt well enough to get out and vote. Um, my husband and I... Um, We were trying to figure out when I could get out to vote because I need a lot of help when it comes to um, getting around or being mobile um, in places. So um, I was able to stop at the station and uh, he helped me get my wheelchair out and I was able to go and wait in line and vote and that was uh, an experience. Uh, which I voted last, I think, three elections, not three presidential elections, but in the last three for our state. So, um, you know, it's just something that I do, but I did not get a mail-in ballot uh, this time, so I was not able to do that, plus the previous other times I was a little more mobile so I was able to do that uh, the other thing so thing number two is one of my best friends um, she is she since I've met her she's been there through thick and thin she's quite a doll um, she's my ginger but she invited me over to her house and I got to take Theo and he got to meet kitty cats which sort of went well until one of the cats ran and then he ran and he's a standard poodle but he's more bulky so that didn't go awesome but i got to hold a cat so that was great um in my household we're kind of super allergic to cats therefore we don't have cats except for me i'm the only exception Thing number three was at the beginning of the week, my husband came home with a tub of ice cream. There's that. Um, let's see. Thing number four was that my state turned blue, normally red. Um, but when I saw our state turn blue, I got so excited. Um, and I just, I'm really happy about it. Um, so I'm, I'm very happy. Congratulations on that win, Joe and Kamala. I can't wait to see what you do in the next four years um, to take care of America. Thing number five. I think I might only do five, but I might, I might just keep going because there was some good things this week. Um, I got to go to this Mexican restaurant that I absolutely love that we live down the street from. It's 
called Casa Real and it's authentic and delicious and uh, it used to be a laundromat um, but now it's now it's not and so they have like the best chips and cheese ever I was wanting it really bad yesterday um, but my husband was at the station all day because he's a firefighter um, working on things for stuff he had to do today so um, when he got home he was kind of pooped so um, he went to bed and promised me he'd get up in the morning and go after he got done with the training so we went and we ate and we went we saw we conquered I think would be maybe like the best thing to put there um, oh this was another good thing. So I watched uh, Sophia's new video and she wore a wig from Webster's Wigs and I so very happy about that. I love Webster's Wigs. If you are in need of a wig, that is the place to get it. Um, I feel like because I found out about them through Made You Look and I was like, I, I've been having problems this past year with hair loss. Um, so past few years but um I've been so insecure and so one of the things that helps me feel a little more um, confident is to have full beautiful hair um, I haven't really worn them out too much in public due to the word that shall not be named I don't know everyone else keeps calling it that I think it's because they're technically monetized and that's like a shadow ban word um but I'm just gonna go with it so a word that cannot be named um, I haven't really been out too much to be able to wear them or really care whether or not anything is going on with my hair so um, yeah I've got this really pretty pink dusty I think it's called dusty rose and it's like got these blue gray roots and then it's a like a baby pink um, and it's pretty long. It goes down to maybe the middle of my back. Yeah, it's pretty great. Um, and then I got another one from them and it's like an auburn and it's curly and I think it's an L, but it goes, it goes to maybe where my hair is right now. And it's very curly and just luscious looking. Um, but I need to also get the glue so I can on correctly. Well, I think I've got two more good things. Um, one more good thing was uh, that I won the Color Street raffle through my friend's party um, and VIP group. Uh, so I won Holidays, which is this super glittery um, with a black kind of background. Um, and then also, I just updated uh, my Etsy shop, The Crafting Aries, because, you know, I, I'm crafting and I'm an Aries, so, you know, um, but I just posted more stuff up on that and um, you should definitely go check it out, especially if you're looking for gifts for your loved ones. Um, and also do custom items um, so those would be tons of fun to uh, make for you too so go check them out and uh, the last thing that is good is we went and picked up the lumber for my desk that we are going to be creating in this corner where this bookshelf is for all of my crafting needs for um, you know just to work at since I don't work at a place <laughs> I in our little office space right now uh, we just have my husband's desk and that is not big enough for the both of us because I am well the best way to explain it is I'm an Aries so I'm a little messy so we also got the lumber to be able to build my tabletop for part of my desk and so hopefully that'll be a series for you guys soon um i gotta work on cleaning out this entire corner it 
has most of my current stuff in it. Um, and cleaning off this bookcase and um, finding the perfect rug. I don't know. Just to um, make it a little more me on this side of the room. Um, and um, those were my good things this week. If you have any good things, I would love to hear them down in the comments. Um, I love hearing from you guys. Uh, right now, I am able to respond to every single one of you. So if you comment something, I can respond. So uh, if you would like to tell me some of the good things that happened to you this week, or even just one, um, I would be glad to hear it. If you like my videos, make sure you go and give it a thumbs up, press that subscribe button, and I'll see you in another video.